Hi, I'm Dr. Bill Adams, and welcome to No Spin Live, episode number seven. This is everybody's favorite show where you get credible information from the world's best plastic surgeons. So with us today, we have Dan Del Vecchio from Boston, Massachusetts. We've got Jason Posner from Boca Raton, Florida, and we have Tiffany McCormick from Reno, Nevada. And let's get into them. So number one, I don't know, maybe this is like same song, different verse, but a model or some famous person says, oh my God, I did all this plastic surgery and now I'm disgusted by it. Danielle Lloyd, this story, you know, she had breast implants placed in like 2004 and then she said her breast implants exploded in 2012 and she just is very unhappy about how she looks. Dan Del Vecchio, what's the deal with this trend of famous people saying they are disgusted with plastic surgery? It's always the same old crap over there. The UK, some famous person had this and that. There's that guy who's had 55 operations. I think it's a bunch of bull. I mean, everyone has plastic surgery. The complication rate's not that high. Tiffany, what do you think? Yeah, I was a little disturbed by her comment about saying if she had known what the risks were, she probably would never have gone through with her procedures. And I have to believe that any plastic surgeon worth their salt would have gone over risks and benefits preoperatively. It sounds like she had no explosion, but a hematoma, which is a known complication. It's rare, but it happens. It sounds like she's also had a couple of children in between having various breast procedures, so I'm sure things changed. You want to make a good decision the first time, but sometimes people don't make good decisions, which is unfortunate, but if you make a bad decision, can those people be helped? Well, you know, a lot of my practice is re these revisionary surgeries. So definitely, like, I see this stuff every single day. Like, today was a clinic day. We saw lots of messed up boobs. You know, unfortunately, the, there is a low complication rate, and things get old, and they change. So we do need to fix them. That's why you need to go to someone who knows how to fix these problems. But on the other hand, if I can comment on this case again, is this person, who is this person? I've never heard of them. Are they famous? Are they not famous? Are they now famous because they have exploding breast implants? So I think it's someone looking for a little bit of attention. Dan, you got the last word on this one. I just think, you know, people have to be better educated and, and, and you know, the tabloids have now turned into the electronic tabloid. You guys have been great. I think it's been really uh, some really good good information. We appreciate you guys being with us and I'm sure our viewers have learned a lot. And if you want to see more of this, you can see that at theplasticsurgerychannel.com.